It's awfully early for me to be getting ready for something like this, but here I am. Hey guys, it's Julia back with another video. Welcome back to my channel, or if you're new, welcome to my channel. I literally look pretty insane, but today is a day I have literally been waiting for since July. The tour was announced, since everything came out. I bought tickets for one location three hours away from me because he didn't have a location where I lived, and then he added a location where I live, so I had to like figure out what I was gonna do, and it was just a huge mess. But here I am, getting ready for Uzi's pink tape tour. You know me, you know Uzi is just like my day one. Like I've been listening since I was in 6th, 7th grade. I'm just, I'm so obsessed with him. Just the cutest, sweetest, like literally he's on my wall. This isn't a video for me to just like sit here and like meat ride Uzi the whole time. I'm gonna be taking you guys through the getting ready process and I'm gonna vlog some of it. I've been trying not to record at concerts recently or like record one or two songs and then leave it at that. I've been trying to just like live in the moment more. I always have so much more fun when I just put my phone away but then like at the end of the night I'm like fuck I wish I had more videos but like it's either one or the other and honestly I've seen Uzi three times. I have plenty of video in my phone, so today I'm gonna, like, live in the moment. I'm going with my friend Rashid, but I know a lot of other people going. I know at least, like, ten people actually gonna be there, and I'm super excited to be going with Rashid. Me and Rashid have gone to so many concerts together. We went to Cardi together. We went to Yeet together. We went to Ken Carson together. I've seen him at, like, Lone. I, I saw him at Homicide. Normally, it's, like, bigger groups, though. He's been at a lot of concerts I've been at. Like, we haven't always gone together but like we see each other all the time so i'm super duper excited the way i've been twinkling my toes all fucking day and night just like waiting it's still 3 59 like it's not even four o'clock yet and i'm already getting ready and i want to have plenty of time to like take pictures i hate putting too much makeup on at concerts i just put so much concealer on like without even thinking about it i'm just so used to doing my like regular makeup stupid neither of us wanted to drive which is like very reasonable so we're gonna meet at the train station at 5 30 i also have my Uzi flag on my wall right now. A part of me wants to bring it to the concert. I know a lot of people are gonna have them like, and I also like don't want to mess it up. This may be like one of the only opportunities for me to bring it because normally when I see him it's at festivals and to go to festivals you kind of like travel and I wouldn't want to carry around like a flag an entire day of a festival and I don't know when the next time he'll go on tour will be. So it's kind of like either I do it now or I never do it. It's very likely that I am gonna do it i just want to think the idea through a little more and i want to like test out how it feels like holding it if i'm like jumping around somebody like snatches it out of my hand they can easily run away into the crowd and i'll never see that thing ever again in my life so that's why i'm like i don't want to be stupid about it i don't know there's quite the things to consider i'm actually breaking out so bad right now i'm also like not feeling like 100 i have just a super weak immune system for whatever reason and of course it always chooses to be weak when i have to like go places and like do fun stuff doing my makeup is gonna go a lot faster than i anticipated it to and i don't really want to do my hair yet because i want to go get food first i don't know what i want and i could make something but i also like don't know what i'd eat if i made something so maybe i'll just go get food on the way it's better that i'm getting ready early because i never fucking know my plans until like the last minute then shit gets hectic whoopsie i know a lot of people going but i don't know if like i would say hello to any of the people I know going. It's just like an awkward three to five people that are probably going. But if I see you, it's just gonna be like really awkward. Nice to see you as well. Maybe I won't even see them. It's a pretty big venue. Hopefully I'll be fine. School has been kicking my ass. I literally have like a million and 12 assignments due over the break. You know how they give you like a break and then they're like, oh yeah, here's your break, but also do these 40,000 assignments. At that point, just don't even give me a break and don't give me all that extra work. I lost my blush brush. It's probably over there. No, because I've been lost it. I have no clue where it is. I'm using this like super pink blush because everything has to be extra pink today. This blush is pink, but is it pink enough? I love pink tape. I know a lot of people have like controversial opinions on it, but I absolutely loved it. I thought it was so fun. He wasn't playing it safe. I love when people take risks and try new things. I can't find my jewels that I normally put on my face. Should I do another jewel on my temple like he has? I'm gonna do all the other makeup first. Let's see what eyeshadow I want to do. I know I want to do some 
eyeshadow. I might do like this hot pink. Okay, I'm just putting like a lot of pink. My motto is as long as you don't judge what somebody else is doing, it doesn't matter what you do. Like I'm wearing like a bra top and I'm gonna freeze my ass off until I get there. It's okay because it's part of like the fun. Okay, the glitters in this palette are so creamy, but I feel like they're not showing up well. Uzi just makes me feel like glittery. But now I just like look like insane. Once I put mascara on, it'll probably like fix itself a little bit. Then I have like this glitter, which I'm about to put on. I think I'm gonna do it like the same way I did last time. I don't know where my highlighter brush is either. I don't have school tomorrow, which is great. I still have to like get up and work though, but I guess it's better than going to school. I want to paint my nails pink too. I'm probably gonna do that after my makeup. My camera keeps like focusing into weird lighting. Sorry about that. Okay, it actually works way more than I thought it would. I don't know if I want to go over my nose. Like, is that like weird? My outfit is like kind of similar to the one that I wore to Rolling Loud for Uzi. I was gonna go thrifting to find a new one, but I didn't have time. I think I'm just gonna end up wearing like the similar outfit. Sorry if I'm talking about concerts so much in this video. I'm so excited. A lot of my like old talking stages are gonna be there. That's like so funny to me. Uzi, bro, it's gonna be like triple the amount of people that I think I'm gonna know because just like everybody listens to Uzi and it's like not everybody, but like Uzi has a lot wider of like a reach than a lot of the other artists I listen to. I hope it stays. Okay, let me do my mascara. I feel like I should have done my hair first, but whatever. Uh -huh. I'm almost out of this mascara. I'm actually so hungry. I need to get food before I go. Like, I have to get food somewhere. I actually love the way my face looks right now. I feel like I look super cute. I had a huge test this week, so I was like, oh my god, am I gonna even make it through this week? I don't know if I'm gonna make it through tonight. Like, okay, I'm loving the look. Like, I'm actually, I think I actually ate. I just need to add a gloss that's a little bit darker. I'm planning to put my hair in two pink tails, so I'm gonna at least try it, because I also have these glasses that I want to wear that are super duper cool. I'm gonna look like a seven-year-old with this makeup and this hair but like that's kind of the point i feel like okay here we go i'm literally like nearing adult status and i look like i'm seven years old i'm gonna try to stick some of these gems to my head but i hate doing this because i have to put a lot of hairspray on it for them to stick okay it's actually not that bad i was over exaggerating there's just glitter everywhere now oh yeah mind that it's literally downpouring outside rain concerts are always fun like a weird type of fun it's like not actually fun but it's like if you prepare for it the right way it can be very very fun i'm painting my nails pink right now bow 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 I'm just letting my nails dry right now. I'm probably gonna put my outfit on. This is like the final makeup. The pink every fucking wear, every angle. Fucking glitter everywhere as well. My hair in pink tails. Now I'm gonna have to figure out what I'm about to do with this outfit because I genuinely like have not a singular clue. So I'm a little bit like worried about what I should wear. Guys, my fit is literally inane. It just doesn't look good at all because I tried to make it warmer. Initially, I wasn't gonna wear the white thing that's underneath this under it. But I decided that like for sake of warmth, I should probably have something else underneath it. I literally just like completely changed it last minute to try and make it warmer. It doesn't make sense at all, but that's why I feel like it's cute because it doesn't make sense at all. Like, doesn't it look so cute with that flag? I have my goggles on. I forgot that I was gonna have these on or else I wouldn't have done the jewels. Probably just gonna put Converse on with it, like realistically speaking. I don't have the patience to do anything else. This belt is gonna like flop up all night and just piss me off. And I wore these pants because I wanna have pants with pockets. I'm happy to start getting ready so early this is it um it's literally insane and crazy but i kind of love it also probably gonna take that down after i take a few videos and pictures and see like if i want to bring it with me or not okay you guys i'm risking it all and i'm taking it i'm just hoping that like nobody tries to snatch it off of me it's literally around my neck and i probably won't really take it off around my neck but from the back you can see like oozy and it'll also keep me warm from the cold i'm about to go right now because i'm running kind of late it's 5 20 and i want to stop at wendy's and just like get food i think it's time for me to just like get a move on Okay guys, I made it, but I damn near didn't make it. Okay, so I'm driving, right? And I get to Wendy, like they seem like they're really stressed out. Like they're just so stressed out. And then me, I can't drive, right? So they're like, pull up to the next window, but there's a car in front of me that I can't pull around. So I just sit there and I'm like, uh, like I don't really know. And they like gave me the food and then the guy had to like direct me out of there. And then I checked my damn meal and they gave me the wrong meal. I ordered a 10 piece nugget meal and you know they tax their 10 piece nugget meals. I got four for four instead. By the time I was out, I was like, you know what? 
what, bro? I'm already like running so late. I'll just like, I'll just take the damn four nuggets and skitsy on my day. I never drive in rain this bad. It like scared the fuck out of me driving in rain this bad because I was like, bro. Like I hydroplane today, so I was like extra scared. And then I was in the wrong lane. I was in a turn only lane. I was supposed to go straight. So I'm sitting there trying to wait and hope people don't come up behind me. Of course people come up behind me, but then they're honking at me. So then I go and then I run the light. That was actually one of the most hectic and stressful things in my life. The only thing that I got correct was my drink. Like my life flashed before my eyes like 10 times when I was driving right there. I just need to take a breath. I feel like I look like an emo nerd. I'm gonna call her to you because it's been like 10 minutes. Fuck you and fuck Guys, I'm back in my car. The concert was literally insane, bro. I'll put in as many videos as I have, but it was insane. I honestly didn't vlog anything else. I'm literally shivering right now. I think I'm gonna talk to you guys when I go home because I just need to like get out of here. Okay, sorry guys, I literally look insane. Like actually, I'm about to go like take a 25 hour long shower. But you know, a point in the night where you're like, I've made it home. Absolutely nothing in the world could go wrong now. Taking my flag off and my flag is looking great. So I was like, awesome. Like not even my flag got ruined. And then my white Uzi shirt that that I bought is stained pink at the armpits. So it looks like I just like sweated pink. So I am doing a bleach bath with it right now. All I want gone is like the armpit bleach. And I love that shirt. I was gonna show you guys that shirt. I was super excited about that shirt. Something silly always has to happen. Guys, look it up fat my keloid is. Guys, comment down below what I should name my keloid. I think she's a girl. Like, she's sassy as fuck. My hair after concerts is always just, like, so sensitive. Obviously, the shirt wasn't the whole night. I had a great fucking time. Like, I have nothing bad to say about it. I've seen so many people in concerts, and I never feel as exhausted as I do as after I see Uzi. Thank God they let my flag in. Apparently, they, like, didn't let some people's flags in that I talked to. I think it's the way that I wore mine. I'll actually cut in a clip right now of me showing you my shirt oh my god yes okay this side is doing really good like the armpit does it is not giving stained anymore but you can see there's like splotches of pink literally everywhere that are not supposed to be there hopefully it looks good but with that being said i'm gonna go take a shower and then go to sleep i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure you subscribe and hit that post notification bell so you never miss another video and follow my instagram and my tiktok below the link down in the description below and on the screen right now that was lil uzi burt's pink tape tour i love you guys so unbelievably much peace out